What is the general direction of flow of the Sipu Nadi? Given in the map extract, give a reason to support your answer. The general direction of flow of Sipu Nadi is from northeast to southwest because the spot heights are decreasing from northeast to southwest. For example, from spot height 261 to spot height 249. Sipu River is in its middle course in the given map. Give one reason to justify this statement. The reason is because it's flowing through a flat land or the plain area. If a man were to walk from Gulab Ganj to Harmatia, in which direction would he be walking? Which are the two different kinds of roads that he would be using the direction is it's a southeast direction you would be using two types of roads one is cord track and another one is metal road why do you find limited cultivation in the map extracted it is because of scarce rainfall or sandy area or desert area Mention one man man-made features in the map which also provides evidence that the rainfall is seasonal man-made features that is broken ground is a result of weathering caused by alternate wet and dry periods which means that the rainfall is seasonal only broken ground or barren land is the man-made features that shows rainfall is seasonal. How does the feature indicate by the black curves in 0721 show that rainfall in this region is seasonal? Broken down because it is formed by alternate wet and dry spells. Next one, mention any two factors which provide Evidence that the region in the map extract is a rural region or rural areas. Because main occupation here is agriculture. No metal roads, only cot track. Main source of water is lined perennial well or only well is also accepted. Lack of amenities like hospitals which are found in urban areas that is why the given map extracted is a rural region what are the reasons for the presence of causeway in the grid square 3695 the reasons are is a simple reasons actually for the presence of causeway the reasons are it is mainly due to presence of dry or seasonal streams mainly because of dry or seasonal streams dry streams or seasonal streams next one which is also very important the water in some of the wells in the northwest quarter of the map is not fit for drinking give a reason why it is not for not fit for drinking it is mainly because of brackish or saline water which according to you is the most important settlement give a reason for your answer dantrai is the most important settlement because it does all the important things like police station and post office Next one, what do you infer about the climate of the region by the information provided on the map? Give evidence in support of your answer. 
Climate of the region depicted in the map is hot and dry with seasonal rainfall. Evidences are rivers and streams in the map are seasonal in nature. If you were to cycle at 10 km an hour, how much time would it take to cover the north south distance on this map extract? The north south the north south the distance will be also 10 km because we can find 10 grids each grid is equal to 1 km the distance of each grid is 2 cm the scale of the map is 2 cm equal to 1 km so we will get 10 grids 10 into 2 20 cm 20 cm is equal to 10 km the answer is 1 hour give probable reasons other than dry water feature to indicate that the region depicted on the map extract receives seasonal rainfall the answer is cot tracks are motorable in the dry season presence of causeway and broken ground the same reasons for man made features okay the same things only questions are different answers are same how does the feature indicate by the black house in 0721 show that the rainfall in this region is seasonal the answer is broken ground it is formed by alternate wet and dry spells so the next one it is also important name the most prominent settlement other than abu give two reasons to support your answers which is the most prominent settlement other than abu actually abu is the most important settlement other than abu is wazna because it has police chowki located on the metal road so good transport facility is also available next one if a person walks from village a to town b at an average speed of 4 km per hour How long will it take if the actual distance on the map is 5 cm? So the given scale here 1 cm equal to 2 km. The scale is 1 cm equal to 2 km. Distance on the map is also given 5 cm equal to 10 km. 5 cm equal to 10 km. If he walks at a speed of 4 km per hour for 10 km he walks 2 hours. 30 minutes for 10 km 2 hours 30 minutes for 4 hour 4 km 1 hour 